Seven straight ranked foes go down. So Illinois or Purdue now with a chance to pull even mathematically with Michigan in the standings. And Purdue running the fake punt. Joe Odom is wearing number 51, or he might have scored. A little trickeration. Goes 52 yards here. You know those linebackers can't take it into the house. Brandon Hans would take advantage looking for Seth Morales. 7-0 Purdue. Purdue controlled this game early. Hans was only 15 to 29 for a buck 32. Kurt Kittner had a tough first quarter and a half. Right here getting picked off by Landon Johnson. And on third down for Purdue, up 7-0. Muhammad Abdullah, who had a big game, puts down Brandon Hans. Purdue had to settle for a 50-yard Travis George field goal. Kittner, Kittner, Kittner. Gilbert Gardner, Purdue, leading the Big Ten in interceptions, coming in, picked off Kittner three times in the first quarter and a half. This one going back 51 yards. Guess who rises up again for the Illini? Abdullah? Abdullah. Oh, yeah. Abdullah the Butcher cutting down Montrell Owen. Purdue gets nothing and likes it. Later in the second, Kittner looking, not for Stuart Schweiger, but that's who he found. The Illini D would have to rise up again, and they would. Christian Morton making a play on John Standerford. Purdue had to settle for a field goal. Purdue only six points off four Illinois turnovers. They also got a fumble. They did not put this game away. And guess who made them pay? Oh, that would be Kittner and Brandon Lloyd. 47 yards here on a touchdown. They blitzed Kittner in the first half, knocked him around, twisted his knee. But in the second half, he came back. Look at that first half performance. Three picks. Second half, uh-uh. Much deeper, much better. Here he finds Young down the sideline. A touchdown again. Gives him a 17-13 lead. Here's Kittner firing over the middle and Young up and over. Yamo be in the end zone. 20-yard touchdown in the Illini. Seized control of this thing. Not only seized control, they ran away with it. 38 to 13 after Purdue missed an opportunity, Mark, to get control. And two of Brandon Hans's interceptions were returned for touchdowns. That was the tale of this game. Illinois was down 13 to nothing in this game, decided to come back when they wanted to play, and they played hard throughout the game. Okay, so Michigan and Illinois.